Introducing facts on concrete durability. Durability of concrete mix is becoming very essential for determining service life of buildings. Buildings made with concrete having poor durability will show distress in 15 to 30 years and will require repairs and rehabilitation. Corrosion of steel is single most common reason for early distress in RCC buildings. Corrosion of rebars and porous concrete is initiated due to ingress of moisture and air. It is further accelerated by carbonation and chloride attack from atmosphere. Giving proper cover to rebars, maintaining low water cement ratio, use of fly ash and GGBS in concrete are best ways to reduce rebar corrosion and enhance life of RCC buildings. Ability of a concrete mix to offer protection to rebars from corrosion is measured by two common tests water penetration test and rapid chloride penetration test. Water penetration test, IS 516 part 2. Water is applied at pressure of 500 kPa on concrete cylinder for 72 hours and maximum depth of water penetration in concrete is measured. As a general guideline, the depth of water penetration in durable concrete should not be more than 50 millimeters. The RCPD test is done by placing concrete specimen in solutions of sodium chloride and sodium hydroxide to create a cell. The charge parsing through concrete specimen in 6 hours, under 60 volts is measured. Higher the charge parsing through the concrete specimen, greater is the chloride permeability of concrete. Chloride permeability is classified as below. Chloride permeability is high when charge passed in more than 4,000. Chloride permeability is moderate when charge passed in between 2,000 to 4,000. Chloride permeability is low when charge passed in between 1,000 to 2,000. Chloride permeability is very low when charge passed in between 100 to 1,000. It is a good practice to keep chloride permeability below 2,000 coulombs. Test durability of concrete with Duracrete. 